Leader of the Islamic movement in Nigeria, Sheikh Ibrahim El Zagzaki, has, for the first time since his release from DSS custody, spoken to journalists about the ordeal of he and his wife all through the six years they spent in detention. He says they are still in dire need of medical attention abroad to surgically remove bullet fragments lodged in their bodies after the deadly clash between the military and his followers. The international passport of the leader of the Islamic movement and his wife is still being withheld by the state security services more than four months after a Kaduna State High Court discharged and acquitted them of criminal charges. Sheikh El Zagzaki denies claims by the federal government that about 3.5 million naira was spent on feeding him and his wife monthly. He says he was personally responsible for his upkeep during his incarceration and also paid the utility bills of the detention facility. Throughout, even when I was in Abuja, we were feeding ourselves. But we could, we, would, we could not see because we were feeding ourselves also illegally. Because legally they are supposed to feed us. All right? But they don't want anybody to hear that we are feeding ourselves. We are actually fed ourselves all the years, five, five, five years, seven months. We were in detention. Throughout, we were feeding ourselves. Nobody gave us a bottle of water.